Okay, in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how you can install Zencart. Now Zencart is a uh, open source um, free shopping cart software program. Um, you can install it for free. Some of you out there might want to try to do it yourselves but I don't recommend that uh, because if you make a mistake you could do a whole bunch of other work on your website and then in a week from now you could find out that you just messed up the installation so you have to start all over again. So I'm going to show you how you can install it uh, easily with an automatic installation so that you make sure it ins gets installed correctly the first time. So uh, what you need is a hosting plan and you need a domain name. Um, if you don't have your hosting plan you can get one over here at usavedomains.com and if you scroll down from the home page you'll see some hosting options here. I would recommend the Linux software program if you want to write that down. Um, it really depends on how many products you're going to be offering, but uh, probably if you want to be safe, probably the middle of the road plan might be the best. That's the one that I'm on myself. Um, so what you can do is after you have it set up and installed on your domain name, you're ready to do the installation. So you're going to log into your account here. On the left side margin, you'll see my products. If you don't see white links there, just click on it and you'll see it appear click on your hosting plan. In the middle of your screen you will see some stuff move around a little bit and then you'll see your hosting plan show up right there. And a little bit to the right of it you'll see launch. I'm going to head into my control center. Now, in your hosting control center there are a lot of options in here, lots of stuff under the tabs. You can see but the area that I want you to focus on is right over here on the right margin. There's all sorts of different applications here if you want to look at them. But the one I'm going to do now is Zencart. Once you click on it, right here in this blue little button, it's kind of hidden, but uh, click on Install Now. You're going to choose your domain name here. Click on it. To scroll down, just if you don't see what to do next, scroll down and you'll see kind of down a little bit lower the next button. You're going to type in a name for your database, so Zencart4 and then My Domain. You'll create a database password, so I'm just going to fill that in. You want to write this information down too and keep it in a safe spot. I'm going to click Next. Now, by default, you're going to see the word Zencart show up in this box right here. This is asking, what folder do you want to install it in? But if you want your shopping cart, if you want people to start shopping immediately when they come to your home page, I want you to backspace over it and just leave it at completely empty. And then click Next. Otherwise, you're going to install it on some other directory, and when people go to your home page, they're going to, you're going to have to create a link over to where your shopping cart is. I'm going to click Next. I'm going to create a Zencart, my admin username section here. Um, so I'm going to create my username, my password, my email address, the name of my store, my address, and I'm going to click Finish. You'll want to write this information down too because this is how you get into your back end admin section on Zencart. Uh, once you click Finish, it'll take about 15 20 minutes to set up, and then you'll be able to log into your back end on your uh, Zencart. Um, there is going to be a back-end link that you're going to need to go to and you should get an email with that letting you know uh, the link to that but if you ever have any questions you can just give us a call and we can help you uh, show you what that link is um, I guess that's basically it so that's how you install Zencart over at usavedomains.com um, if you like the video and you think that other people would benefit from it uh, wherever you're watching it if there's a thumbs up please give us a thumbs up and uh, also, if you're a Facebook member, please, you know, give us a like on that. Um, that'll let other people know about us and be able to help them and grow their business online. All right, thank you. I'll be adding other videos, too. So uh, please bookmark our site. We'll have videos on our homepage. And uh, we look forward to helping you. All right, bye-bye.